statue looks different from the one in the Metropole. It's a different goddess. This one is the goddess of fate. It's all right now, Durin. Nobody here wants to hurt you. Don't say that, Durin! Paimon made a mistake. She was wrong about you. But it's nice to talk, isn't it? Now that we've all calmed down? So that's why you made that wish? <sighs> so stupid. Hey! Anyone with eyes can see that all you want to do is get along with everyone. Hmm. You just want to make friends, people to play with, to talk to, people who accept you, or at least, accept your apology. Oh, you've never hurt anyone. Heck, the idea never even crossed your mind. Sure, you scared a bunch of people half to death, but... That's only because they had no idea what kind of dragon you really are. Yeah. If you had a heart-to-heart -heart with them, I'm sure they'd come to understand you and see your point of view. true wish to live side by side with the people of Simulanka? <laughs> then close your eyes and make a wish to the goddess of fate. We will help make your wish come true. Just trust me. <sighs> I, Nilu, the Forest Fairy, give to you my blessing and welcome you as a dweller of the forest. May everyone accept you as one of our own. And may the Forest of Blessings be a place you can call home. I, Navia, King of Constellation Metropole, give you my blessing. I grant you citizenship to my kingdom. Oh, me too! As the, uh, Nekomata in Boots of this world, I give you my blessing too. Wait, what's going on? <sighs> I, the hero of this world, give you my blessing. I recognize you as a resident of Simulanka. May you find acceptance in this world. Also, speaking as someone who'd like to be your friend, I wish you all the best for the future. I, a traveler who has traversed many worlds, give to you my blessing. May you find friendship and goodwill 
no matter where you go. As for this world, I leave it to you. What? Why are you all staring at me? Huh? My... my claws... Are these my claws? And my wings... Oh, my tail! <gasps> Does this mean... <laughs> wow! You look so cute! Quite a radical transformation! Uh, not that there was anything wrong with the way you looked before, of course. <laughs> it's just... Uh... You get what I mean. How do you feel? Are you happy with your new appearance? Does anyone have a flower with them? Or even just some water or paper from this world? Oh, I do actually. Here you go. They're... they're not changing. I can touch things without changing them. Hey, that's great! One more flying friend for Paimon! Now the residents of Simulanka won't be scared of you anymore. Hmm. But what about all the things that I did before? That's simple. Just go out there and atone. You could fill in the footprints you left on the ground. Or help the people around the Broken Sea get home. Okay. And you'll come along and help me, right, Pat Guy? Huh? Why would I do that? Uh, because you said you wanted to be my friend. You little... Gah. Well, maybe I spoke too soon. Huh? But I thought... <sighs> Alright, fine. I'll go with you. Really? Yes, really. Lying to you would be no fun anyway. Oh, thank you! You're the first friend to call me by my name! <sighs> Let's go back up. I'm about to suffocate down here. Oh, it feels so good to finally see Hat Guy meet his match! <laughs> yeah, okay. Paimon just never thought we'd see the day, that's all. Alright. Let's also head back up then. Uh... Don't be scared, Durin. We'll be right by your side. Mm-hmm! Thank you for your blessings, everyone! Oh, this is the happiest day I've had in a really long time! Whoa.